Hello and welcome to the brand new edition of the Executive Dossier. Today, we present to you Sanjeev Kapoor, the promoter and director of India's first homegrown food channel, Food Food. Sanjeev, in an interview with Seema Singh, talks about the journey of the channel, the growth of the food journal and its acceptance by Indian viewers. So between Astro and I and uh, Sandeep Goel is with me, it's a uh, relationship of equality. See, it was my thought uh, to begin with. I, uh, I first thought of uh, doing a 24-hour uh, TV channel in the year 2003 when I spoke to a few people, uh, they, they just thought that I was mad. They thought that uh, how can uh, a category which is uh, an afternoon category, half an hour slot, how can it be a full budget uh, TV channel? But at that time, I didn't think that I would do it. I thought that someone should do it. But no one was willing to buy, no one was uh, willing to accept that this, this can be an opportunity. Then I started looking uh, outside India. So maybe internationally people who are there, they should look at this option. And I uh, looked at uh, Scripps Network, which is Food Network. Uh, tried contacting them, but they were not interested. There. Then uh, I thought maybe BBC, because they had a lot, a large uh, uh, food content. I spoke to them, and the meeting was fixed in London. I went to London and they never met me. That was the day I said, okay, uh, why am I looking at uh, anyone? I will do it. So it was sheer anger and I came back and started uh, working on it that if one were to launch a TV channel, what does it take? I started thinking, started working on it, started understanding it. And uh, I came across. Uh, Sony's CEO at that time, Anand Das Gupta. One of the first persons who, uh, in some sense, supported this thought was uh, him and Sony. Then I one day discussed this uh, with my friend uh, Sandeep Goyal. Sandeep uh, used to head uh, ZTV, the CEO of ZTV. And I said, I'm trying to do this uh, in partnership with uh, someone, maybe of the media. Houses in India could be Sony, could be uh, anyone could be. He could. So they have. Do you know of Astro? He says they may be very good partners for you. Uh, why don't uh, you speak to them? So that was the time. This, I said, okay, why don't you also you understand TV? So why are you don't come into this? He says I can be a notional. So he also interested. Uh, by that time I had started, I had got the permission, I had got everything, I started making shows, started producing. And uh, with, uh, with the help of uh, well wishes and friends, uh, we started this venture. See, most people would uh, imagine that uh, food content. Uh, would be more uh, women-centric. Uh, in some sense, TV in India, barring sports and news, is women-centric. So anything uh, with large numbers is uh, women-centric. Having said that, uh, now we are seeing that uh, in category like food, uh, men are also walking in, uh, especially in uh, evening time lags. Uh, what is good is that uh, younger TG also is uh, started to, to get excited about uh, this. So when we first uh, started, it was uh, women 35 plus uh, was the core TG. We have been able to bring that uh, down to about uh, 25 and uh, I think uh, this would continue to go uh, even younger. And uh, in terms of uh, cities, uh, city, it's a channel is available in all uh, HSM 
areas and in that uh, north of course is uh, big numbers for us uh, and uh, Maharashtra as well, uh, Gujarat. Bigger cities have uh, great uh, traction, so all, all uh, metros, uh, uh, we get very good numbers. Uh, highest numbers coming from Delhi and Bombay uh, needs to contribute uh, maximum, but other uh, metros also contribute. And, uh, so the quality of households, the way uh, it was the first uh, HD uh, ready channel, I would say. All content from day one that we started producing, all our workload was uh, in HD. Uh, so we were able to get uh, good quality households. Through Food Food, we started uh, producing content in HD so people started to expect good quality uh, content not just boring uh, shows. Since all our content is focused on our core Indian market, uh, we do all as per Indian ethos. Our relevance of content has always been 100%. We have stayed uh, focused on that. We have that understanding and now uh, I often speak to our uh, team that it's not only the understanding of viewers, I think we also have responsibility that uh, which direction, which way food in India should go. We try and see what are the healthy alternatives uh, to cooking. Uh, and uh, so we, we, we feel that uh, if we show it, uh, not only viewers would pick it up from us, but all other shows uh, on any channel, they also follow what we do. We work with research uh, agencies uh, and uh, we do qualitative and quantitative uh, research. Uh, but at the same time, uh, we are always in touch with our uh, viewers. Uh, we constantly do Viewers Connect uh, programs uh, through events. So that gives us a very good idea as to what viewers are saying, what do they want, uh, what do we lack, what do we should do more, what should we cut down on. So that is the biggest learning and no research uh, can be better than that. So internationally we are present uh, currently in Gulf uh, countries, uh, to the Salat, uh, uh, we are there. We are uh, in the process of concluding our uh, deal in the United States. We are present in uh, Canada through ATM. Uh, and, uh, so we are looking at, uh, we are always looking at other uh, markets uh, now because internet has started to uh, become important. So barring uh, US, uh, Canada and India, we are available uh, through uh, uh, many subscribers through Jadu uh, boxes. So uh, we are continuously uh, working on that uh, and uh, uh, opening more and more markets uh, Steady. I, I think uh, regional uh, channels, uh, strong regional channels, uh, they uh, have started to build very good uh, loyalty on food programs. Uh, so they would be our closest uh, competitors. Uh, uh, other than that, uh, GC's large shows are not competitors. Uh, large shows actually help us. Uh, large shows uh, build the category for us. Uh, and uh, we, we hope that more GC channels do food shows. Fortunately, we are in a position, we are uh, by far the number one lifestyle channel uh, in this country by our numbers so uh, we really don't have to worry too much about that uh, and what we see is that most channels uh, with this kind of content are following us as long as that trend continues we are happy uh, if we can lead and others follow uh, but naturally we, we keep a watch on what's happening uh, what's working what's on and uh, we are uh, continuously uh, making sure that we Stay ahead of the curve. Currently, the shows that we have, of course, uh, 
you know, we, we have our different popular shows and hosts, let's say Tandan Takka with Kapal Singh, we've got Sokhi, we have Tea Time, uh, we have Health Market Mall, we have uh, uh, Style Chef, uh, we have uh, Travel uh, shows, we'll be doing more uh, temple uh, uh, shows. Uh, we continuously, uh, Mummy Ka Magic uh, with Amrita, highly successful uh, shows. We have health-based shows with uh, Anjali Mukherjee. <coughs> so, uh, we, we, we keep on doing new seasons of our popular shows. And uh, uh, of course, show that I uh, do, uh, we do different uh, variants of that. We have Sanjeev Kapoor's Kitchen, uh, we have How to Cook uh, uh, series. Uh, we, we have uh, something an emotional uh, food through maki dal so it, it's uh, uh, agatwar is uh, always a mix of our popular shows new series of uh, those and uh, new shows uh, initial marketing we wanted to create the awareness of the channel so we brought in madhuri dikshit as a brand ambassador for lifestyle and uh, now uh, our marketing is uh, more uh, done through shows. So we market our uh, leading shows. And uh, we, we use all mediums. We use uh, outdoor, we use print, we use uh, now digital uh, very effectively. And uh, um, of course, one of the key marketing tools that we uh, use is the on ground activities uh, that we have. Our marketing is uh, of our total budget uh, as high as 20 percent. Food by itself uh, as a category is, uh, we understand, we know that if you look at uh, GCs uh, and uh, uh, the total contribution to the uh, kitty uh, is uh, significant and that uh, significant uh, translates uh, into the total money that is spent uh, on uh, food can have at least four to five food channels if that is the size uh, of food industry. That's the full time job that we have. That's something our team uh, does and we uh, continuously you know, we keep our ears to the ground and that's where our on-ground effort uh, helps us and uh, people always tell you what they want. So we are just serving to a need which is there. So it is a fairly simple task, it's just that you have to listen to people. A reality show for food food may be a show with real people cooking every day, not only for 3 13 weeks. It may be a daily contest, a live daily contest, which is in six cities and there are six winners every day. That is probably a bigger reality show, which may be more relevant to food food. Uh, it's on track and uh, I, I think uh, we our understanding of uh, business is much deeper than what it was. So I don't see no reason that why 